to write a linear equation ax plus by equals c in the form y equals mx plus b and vice versa. Hi guys! Hi. Hello. Welcome to the Sir Fans Learning Challenge! Good morning learners! Today, I'm going to present to you how to write a linear equation ax plus by equals c in the form y equals mx plus b and vice versa. Okay, remember before we have discussed that the form ax plus by equals c is called standard form of a linear equation. Now, y equals mx plus b is called the slope-intercept form of a line. Because in this form, you can see the slope m and the y-intercept b. So, today, we're going to write the standard form into the slope-intercept form. So, let's take this example. Okay, number one. Write 5x plus 4y equals 8 into the form y equals mx plus b. So, paano natin gagawin yun? So, your focus will be kailangan yung left side ng ating equation, ang makikita lang ay y. Okay, because our aim is to rewrite this into this form. So, in the form y equals mx plus b, as you can see, what is written in the left side of the equation is only y. So, how are we going to do that? Okay. So, let's start. On the left side, we have 5x plus 4. And on the right, we have 8. Okay. Let's start to work on it. Dapat daw, yung y lang ang makikita sa kaliwang side ng equation o sa left side. But, we have 5x here. So, anong gagawin para mawala si 5x? Kung meron tayong 5x, para maging 0, dapat meron siyang kapartner na negative 5x. So, yun ang gagawin natin. I have 5x here, plus 4y. And on the right, I have 8. So, para mawala yung 5x, mag a ako ng negative 5x. At kung ano man yung in ko, sa kaliwa, yun din ang i ko sa kanan. That is the addition property of equality. Or APE. Okay? Addition property of equality. Adding the same expression to both sides of the equation will not affect the equation. Okay? And since, again, no, nag-add na tayo ng negative 5x sa kaliwa, ganun din sa kanan, on the left, mangyayari, wala na si 5x. Because if we're going to combine 5x and negative 5x, zero na siya. What we have now on the left is 4y. And on the right, 8 minus 5x, or we can arrange this. We can write first negative 5x and plus 8. So, 8 minus 5x is the same as negative 5x plus 8. Negative 5x will remain negative 5x here and 8 will remain positive. Okay. So, on the left side, meron tayong 4y. But we only need y or 1y. Ano gagawin natin para mawala yung 4 at maging 1? Okay. Whatever the numerical coefficient of y, get the reciprocal of that. And multiply the whole equation by the reciprocal of the numerical coefficient of y. So, the numerical coefficient of y is 4. The reciprocal of that is 1 4. We will multiply both sides of the equation by 1 4. And that is MPE, Multiplication Property of Equality. You know? Yun yung tamang tawag sa ginawa natin. So, if we will multiply this, 1 4 times 4y will give us y. Because 1 times 4 is 4, and the denominator of 4 here is 1. 4 times 1 is 1, or simply cancel 4. Here, 1 4 times negative 5x is negative 5x over 4. Remember? 
we will multiply numerator by numerator. 1 times negative 5x is negative 5x. The denominator of negative 5x here is 1. And 4 times 1 here is 4. Remember, if the denominator is 1, we don't need to write it. That's why wala kang nakikita ang denominator. But actually, the denominator is 1. And next, 1 times 8 is 8. And the denominator of 8 is 1, of course. 1 times 4 is 4. But 8 over 4 can be written as 2. So, therefore, this equation can be written as y equals negative 5x over 4 plus 2. Because 8 over 4 is 2. 5x plus 4y equals 8 in slope-intercept form is y is equal to negative 5x over 4 plus 2. So, let's have the second example. Write 9x plus 2y equals 2 into the form y equals mx plus b. Again, we will do the same thing. Okay. On the left side, we have 9x plus 2y. And on the right side, we have 2. Remember, we need to have y. y only on the left side of the equation. But we have 9x here. So, para mawala ito, we need to add negative 9x. The same thing, we will do that on the right side. And from here, if we will combine 9x and negative 9x, it will give us 0. Kaya, sa kaliwa, 2y na lang ang matitira. At sa kanan, meron tayong 2 minus 9x. Wherein, pwede natin pagpalitin ng pwesto. But negative 9x will remain negative 9x, of course. And 2 will remain positive. And again, para matira lang yung y o yung 2y maging 1y, we will multiply both sides of the equation by the reciprocal of the numerical coefficient of y. The numerical coefficient of y is 2. So, the reciprocal of that is 1 half. So, if we will multiply it by 1 half, 1 half times 2y will give us y. Here, 1 half times negative 9x. 1 times negative 9x is negative 9x. And 2 times 1 here, the denominator of 9 is 2. Plus, 2 times 1 is 2 over 2 is 1. It's like 2 times 1, 2. Denominator of 2 here is 1. 2 times 1 is 2. So, mangyayari 2 over 2 or just 1. So, 9x plus 2y equals 2 in slope-intercept form is y is equal to negative 9x over 2 plus 1. Okay, this time, we will proceed to the contrary. We're going to write the slope-intercept form into the standard form. Okay, let's take this example. Write the following in the form ax plus by equals c. Okay, 1, y equals negative 2x plus 7. Okay, so, if we're going to write this in the standard form, remember... The x term and the y term should be written on the left side of the equation. And on the right, we have only the constant term. So, paano natin gagawin yun? So, here, on the left side of our equation, we have y. And on the right, we have negative 2x plus 7. Ang sabi, ang dapat daw yung nasa kanan, yung constant lang. So, We have here, negative 2x plus 7. Itong negative 2x, dapat mawala dyan. So, para mawala yan, kailangan, we need to add the additive inverse. Negative 2x yan, mag add ka ng positive 2x. Para maging 0 siya. And remember, kung anong in mo sa isang side ng equation, i-add mo rin dapat sa kabila. Okay, again, that is APE. 
we added positive 2x to both sides the equation. Okay? Now, in effect, negative 2x and 2x, 0 na. Kaya sa kanan, 7 na lang ang matitira. Sa kaliwa, we have y plus 2x. Okay? We, we may now interchange this. Kasi dapat yung x term ang nauuna. So, we have 2x and y will remain positive plus y. y plus 2x is the same with 2x plus y. Okay? Now, we have rewrite it into the standard form. y equals negative 2x plus 7 in standard form is 2x plus y equals 7. Okay, let's have another one. Write y is equal to 3x over 2 plus 3 into the standard form ax plus by equals c. Okay, the same thing. Ang target natin dapat yung constant term lang ang may iwan sa kanan. Kailangan yung x term mawala. Okay, para mangyari yun. kailangan yung x term mapunta dun sa kaliwa. Okay, now, but in this example, we have fraction. So, we need to remove first the fraction part. To do that, we need to multiply the whole equation by the LCD, and the LCD is 2. Okay, so if we will do that, 2 times y, on the left, magiging 2y, 3x over 2 times 2, makakancel na yung 2. So, we only have 3x. Okay? And, of course, we will not multiply 2 to 3x over 2 only, but also to 3. Ito yun. 2 times 3x over 2 is 3x. And 2 times 3 is 6. Yan. Wala nang fraction. Pag wala nang fraction, gawin na natin yung ginawa natin kanina. 2y is equal to 3x plus 6. Para mawala si 3x, mag tayo ng additive inverse niya. Simple lang. Pag positive siya, para maging 0, add mo yung kabalitara na negative. Kung negative naman, add ka ng positive. Diba? So, nag tayo ng negative 3x dito, syempre pati dito. Okay. So, here, this one will be cancelled out or eliminated kasi 3x minus 3x or 3x and negative 3x is 0. So, we have here 6 and on the right, 2y minus 3x. But remember, in the standard form, x term should come first. So, we have here negative 3x and this y is positive 2y. But... In the standard form of linear equation, the first term should be positive. But in this case, the first term is negative. So what are we going to do to make this positive? Multiply. Just multiply the whole equation by negative 1. So negative 1 times negative 3x is positive 3x. Negative 1 times 2y will be positive. This is negative 2y. And negative 1 times 6 is negative 6. And this is the answer. So, y is equal to 3x over 2 plus 3 written in standard form is 3x minus 2y equals negative 6. Okay, that's all for now. See you next discussion.